Hello you guys, it's me Melanie. Today I'm going to be doing just a little bit of a cozy reading vlog to catch up on my reading goal for the year. So um, I've probably mentioned it in another video, but I'm trying to read 50 books this year. I'm at 30, which is actually five behind um, being like on track. Goodreads like kind of tells me what book number I should be on if I'm going to finish my goal in time. And I have gotten pretty far behind because I took some summer classes and now I'm back in school. So my goal for the weekend is basically to possibly finish the two books I'm in the middle of and then start a third one, which is kind of ambitious for me because I do read a lot, I would say for like an average person, but as far as for an average reader, maybe I don't read quite as much. Anyways, I have fallen behind, but we're going to try and fix that this weekend. So that is my goal. I'm going to take you guys along with me for a pretty chill little vlog and I'm pretty much just planning on it being the weekend but maybe I'll end up doing a whole week we will see so that is the plan and um, I guess I'm just gonna get started and you guys will kind of see how much I can read if I like really try to read a lot in a certain weekend so let's get started mm -hmm. is now the next day i finished dial a for aunties last night gave it four and a half stars i really liked it i think for me to be able to sit down and just read like over half a book in one sitting obviously i really enjoyed it because sometimes i like am the type of person who has to take more breaks while reading so i really sat and just like was able to read it all in one go and it was really good it's really funny and so far we're doing so good for being on track for the weekend because um, like I said my goal is to read hopefully two books this weekend and start a third one um, which is kind of a lot for me in a weekend so I've already finished one and it's just Saturday morning now and so I'm trying to decide what I want to read next I have some options I'll show you guys so I'm in the middle of rereading a lot of series because I feel like in the fall time you just want to go back to your roots and so I have been like rereading Percy Jackson and Harry Potter but I also just purchased the selection which I've already read but I didn't actually have it before and so now I'm kind of like wanting to reread all three of these but I don't know which one I should do next I have already started the Battle of the Labyrinth so I'm thinking I might do this one and I'm on book four or five so it might be good to like go ahead and just read this one start the last one and get this series done but I also have really been wanting to continue with the Harry Potter series um, because me and one of my friends are trying to go through and rewatch all the movies and I kind of want to read the book again before I watch the movie again because I know there's some details I've forgotten and so I don't want to like spoil it for myself with the movies. So um, other thing I'm considering is like all of these books are pretty fast reads and um, I had said that I'm five books behind my reading goal which now I'm four so a little bit of improvement but I'm trying to read books that I know I'll like fly through just to get back on top of my reading goal and then after that I'll kind of pick books that are more like things I haven't read before or like more challenging reads and things like that so I do know that if I picked up the selection series I could probably read like the whole series this week because the first time I read them that's what I did, um, but and I really, really do want to read this, but I think what I'm going to make myself do is finish this book, because I have, I've read like one chapter of it, I think. Um, yeah, so I think I'm going to try and read this book today, and then maybe tomorrow I'll start one of these. So yeah, I think that's the plan.
Alright you guys, a little bit of an update. Um, so yesterday I actually did not end up reading nearly as much as I had planned on. I um, don't actually get to spend a lot of time with either of my parents nowadays and yesterday me and my mom both kind of had nothing going on so I ended up just kind of having a day with her. But um, so I, I had planned to read like the whole book yesterday and I did get a third of the way through it so I mean I still read a pretty good amount. I read to page 122. Um, so that's definitely not bad for a day just in general, but I didn't get as far as I had hoped. So I'm hoping today, um, I have a bit of a busier day today. I just got back from church, which is why I'm a little more dressy than probably usual. Um, so I had church and then, um, this afternoon I also have to go back to church for another thing. And so I don't really know how much I'm going to be able to read because I have to study too for some tests coming up. But my goal, I think, is to get like two thirds done today. And um, if I could finish it today, that would be great. But we'll just have to see how much time I end up having. Um, and then I think I'm going to continue the vlog for a couple more days until maybe I finish a third book. So um, we'll see. And maybe I'll even just keep it going and do like a full week of reading. Um, when I went into this video, I had planned on it just being like a little weekend vlog, but I kind of had the idea that. I could continue and just show you guys like how much I can read in a week when I'm really like trying to read a good amount. So um, we'll see, I guess, depending on how long the video is, you'll see whether or not I do the whole week or not. But um, yeah, so today the goal is to get to page like 240-ish through like chapter 14. So let's see if we can read like that much today. I feel like that'd be pretty good. Um, so far I am loving this one. Um, I don't remember this book at all, like, from when I read it as a kid, and so I think not having any recollection of it makes me, like, more excited to read it than I had been about some of the other books in this series, so I'm really, really enjoying this, and I, um, I really want to read more today, um, but it is a bit of a busy day. So we'll see where I get, and I will keep you all updated. <laughs> day it's now Monday morning so so far I kind of have failed the goal I had for the weekend of reading two books but I am really close um, so I got to page 250 last night of this book and I'm gonna try and finish it today and then start another book either tonight or tomorrow so I think I'm gonna keep the vlog going until I finish three books um, and at that point we should be down to like being only two behind schedule so that should be pretty good um, but yeah, so far I am absolutely loving this. Honestly, I think it might be my favorite one so far. Um, I've mentioned that I've read this series before, but I actually have like zero recollection of this one. And um, it's just been so interesting. It's been like, super fun and exciting. So I'm very excited to read more. I wanted to finish it all last night, but it was getting really late and I could not keep my eyes open. So today we're going to try and finish the last like 110 pages. And uh, I think I should be able to do that. It's not like a super difficult book to get through. I probably won't be able to vlog quite as much because I'm going to be at school today. And I feel kind of weird vlogging at school. So um, we'll see how much footage I actually get. But yeah, if I don't get any vlog footage, I will talk to you guys in just a second. <laughs> guys I just finished um the battle of the labyrinth and like 
why was it so good like why was I don't even know like I don't have the words the whole series is great but this one for whatever reason just got me in the last like 60 pages I was close to crying like multiple times why was it so emotional so I think what we're gonna have to do is start the final book of the series tomorrow so yeah but for now I need to go to sleep because I have class in the morning so yeah I will talk to you guys soon